Hi, this is Miss Easy E. I'm back at you again to talk about the college bribery scandal. Tell us about this scandal. Well, this scheme is the Department of Justice's largest prosecution on college admissions. Um, they charged about 50 people in six different states, and there are more to come. Um, basically, to put it in layman terms, if you're wealthy, you can buy your, your child, your students, ACT scores, get them into certain colleges, like just bypass the admissions process, as well as get them on sports teams to play for these Ivy League schools while everyone else would have to try out. Is there an indictment or have individuals just been charged? Individuals have been charged and they do have the indictment online. Um, if I'm not mistaken, these, the, the only ones that haven't been charged is the universities and the, and the students whose parents did this. But the, the parents, the coaches, admissions facilitators, they've all been charged. Who are the victims in this case? The victims are the hardworking students who use their own merit to try to get into these schools. These students had great grades, great scores. Their athleticism was on fleek and they still did not get in because when it boils down to certain spots, well, if Wolf has paid for six spots, then the other four are gonna be more, more out of 10, the other four are gonna be more harder to obtain. Are the students of the parents who utilized the scheme victims? No, I believe they knew what their parents were doing. Um, they were perpetrators. They, for example, if, if you didn't try out to be on the rowing team and you magically got on there, how do you think that happened? So no, they weren't victims. What connection does wealth have in criminal behavior, if any? Well, wealth can breed a criminalistic mindset. Growing up in wealth can make you feel as though you're bulletproof, you're untouchable. Um, you're just not sanctioned to the same consequences as someone who's not wealthy. Um, honestly, if their parents get linear sentences, I wouldn't be surprised.